Hello, and welcome back to another epic episode of my fabulous Iron Man journey in this beautiful game. So, I'm slowly coming back to where I left before going full AFK skills to 120. It's Elite Dungeons 3, Shadow Reef. Still, don't have Eldritch Crossbow. I have one piece that I got uh, from my first kill with a Death Touch dart. A couple darts later, I got Ambipet. So, I technically had 0 KC crossbow piece and a pet. Now, I have 50 ambassador kill count and 21 is killed with darts. So, I am on drop rate and going for another piece. I hope I will get it soon. Haven't gotten the McFace sword yet. Maybe this is the one and of course it isn't. <laughs> Next kill for sure. First kill of Krasian, Leviathan, or whatever it's called, uh, is going down. And it's my 75th kill, and I get some blackstone arrow tips. <laughs> Maybe someday I'm gonna use them. This boss always gives me trouble. But the more I kill, I get uh, more used to it. Oh nice, Hydric's ball tips are always good. I can kill Ambassador solo myself, but it was a long time ago. And I collected a lot of Death Touch darts, so why not use them here? Let's see what I get. Oh, nice. Again, Hydrix Ball Tips and 5 Blackstone Hearts. That's a decent drop. Another run, another Levitian kill. And I get Hydrix Ball Tips again. <laughs> nice, what's up with, uh, with my luck? Can I get more Hydrix Ball Tips? Ah, uh, this time it's only uh, Ghostly Essence. Hi, big boy. Can I get another crossbow piece, please? I guess not. Oh, not even blackstone hearts. I'm sure I will get it next kill, for sure. Another day, another arch glacier reaper task, again. I got 15 to kill, and I went here after darting ambassador. So, 3 kills did not count for reaper assignment, because after using that touch dart, you won't get any KC on a boss for 15 minutes. So instead of 15, this reaper I did 18 kills. And you can guess it, I didn't get my damn book again. But I'm fine with it, because I have a reason to come back here, and it's a very nice boss to do. I know, I know, mining seven stones on Iron Man? Am I insane? I just love this, just load a mining preset, and click once every five minutes, and I'm almost 90 million experience in mining. And I'm soon gonna be 120. Uh, as for smithing, I just recently hit six, uh, 40 million experience mark. I'm a very long way from 120 smithing. But I have my dailies that I do every day for 212,000 experience. And I have banked around hmm, maybe tw 20 million experience too. So I'm not that worried about it. I think I'll be fine. I have only one smithing brawling gloves, and using them with power burst potion, I get 10 to 15,000 experience per one charge. It should uh, get me around 6 million experience. I hope I will get some of those gloves more. <laughs> that will be insane to get at least one more pair. I'm still trying to get Tavia's road. I don't even know how much I spent on these maps, but a lot of money gone here, effigy and the reaper gift are always nice to buy. And let's see, maybe this is finally time to get the red map, and it's not. Reaper points are always nice, and for effigy, I'm gonna use it on smithing, even though runecrafting is a better option to use, but it's smithing for now. Well, tomorrow we're gonna try again. My goal for now will be reaper tasks and shadow reef grind. I want to finally get the uh, eldritch crossbow. I hope I will get it soon. So this is gonna be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and if you did leave a like. If you want to see more of my videos subscribe and I see you in my next episode. Au revoir.